Hey friends, it's me, Pastor Doug, with another one minute word of encouragement for the day for today, Tuesday, July 14th. And today's word comes from the words of Jesus in John chapter 15. I'm gonna read verses nine and 10, and then I'm gonna also add verses 12 to help explain what in the world Jesus is talking about. This is what he says. He says, and this is, this is the night before he is going to be executed. He's with his disciples in an upper room and he says these words. He says, as the Father has loved me, so I have loved you. And then he says this, he gives instructions. He says, now remain in my love. And it's really easy to go, Jesus, what does that mean? What does it mean to remain in your love? Well, he actually tells us, he explicitly explains what it means to remain in his love. He says this, if you keep my commands, you will remain in my love just as I have kept the Father's commands and I remain in his love. So Jesus is saying, in other words, the way that I remain in the love of the Father is I obey him. And the way that you, my disciples, remain in my love is you obey my commands. And so we go, okay, what are your commands? We start going through all the gospels and reading all the things that Jesus said. And we think, well, gosh, what if we miss something? Like, what if there's not something that, you know, something that didn't get written down? Like, are we not gonna be able to remain in his love? Well, then Jesus sums up all of his teachings in one verse in verse 12 and listen to what he says. He says, my command, you know, the command that I'm telling you to obey in order to remain in my love. He says, my command is this, love, each other as I have loved you. Friends, that's powerful and profound and deep and anything but easy to do. But may you this week love people the same way that Jesus has loved you. And may he equip and empower you by the power of Holy Spirit, his Holy Spirit in order to actually be able to love that way. Have a great day and we'll see you tomorrow.